Good morning, everybody. Top of the day to you. Recently, somebody commented something along the lines of, I can't figure this guy out. He criticized leftists, but he also belongs to the International Union. So how does this work? Am I just in this state of cognitive dissonance where I'm supporting things that don't make sense? I like to think not. It's possible, but I like to think not. So how can I criticize people like Anita Sarkeesian and also be a staunch union member? Let me put it this way. In that film, The Sarkeesian Effect, they mentioned, they interviewed a adult film star, actually a sex worker, as I recall, and she got offended with Anita. We're on a first name basis now, as you can see, because Anita took away her agency from her, she said, considering her a helpless victim who is prostituted by these big forces. Thus, some people see Anita as condemning sex workers. But the IWW, the Industrial Workers of the World, whom I belong to, don't see sex workers in the same way. In fact, they try to unionize sex workers. And there is an actual part of the union, a branch of the union dedicated to unionizing sex workers. The IWW is not there to say, you're wrong for what you're doing. Instead, they're there to say, what can we do to help you to make your life better? They're not going to criticize you for what you choose to do, but at the same time, they want to help you avoid any harmful pimps or bosses in your field and get the most from what you can get. So it's a position of non-judgment. It's a position of actually helping. Some people who are in leftism are there to condemn and victimize people. Others are there to empower. So the, you always got to ask yourself, are the leftists there to empower or are they there to victimize?